When Patricia was diagnosed with breast cancer on her left side, she underwent surgery and chemotherapy, but she was surprised to learn her radiation could have long-term risks. It could cause some damages to your heart. Um, and basically 15 to 20 years down the road. This risk of radiation exposure to the heart in women with left-sided breast cancer was recently confirmed in a New England Journal of Medicine study. Researchers found the higher the dose of radiation, the higher the risk, which begins within a few years after exposure and continues for at least 20 years. But Sunnybrook Health Sciences Center is now increasingly using a simple technique to reduce this risk, called active breathing control, or ABC, Eligible breast cancer patients simply hold their breath while radiation is being administered, says radiation oncologist Dr. Justin Lee. Historically, there's a risk of uh, an increased risk of heart disease with radiation, uh, and that's decreased with time. But we hope that this uh, additional technique would be helpful for some patients um, to further reduce their risk and further reduce any radiation dose to the heart. Patricia has been using ABC during her treatments. She wears a clip on her nose and a snorkel-type device in her mouth. This equipment helps measure and hold her breath during radiation, and she can release her breath anytime just by pressing this button. Medical physicist Dr. Claire McCann says ABC can have a huge impact. The image on the left shows a patient with normal breathing, and we can see the heart here is in the radiation field shown in yellow. With a big breath hold, the heart is pulled out of the radiation field, so we're just treating the breast, which is shown here on the right. Okay, when you're ready, take a deep breath in and hold, please. Patients require a certain anatomical shape to benefit from this technique and need to be able to hold their breath for a minimum of 15 seconds. Once we realize that a patient will benefit from this treatment, we set them up with a device and we help them get comfortable with the technology. So we actually put the snorkel in their mouths and we ask them to hold their breath repeatedly. Once they do that, we determine what breath hold is comfortable for the patient for treatment. Dr. Lee says because so many more women are surviving breast cancer, reducing side effects has never been so important. If we use this technique and protect the heart in, in, in various ways, uh, we can hope to reduce the longer term uh, side effects that, that were seen in the past. In the future, Dr. Lee says ABC may be used in the treatment of lung or liver cancer to also spare adjacent organs from damage. For now, it's been a great advance for patients like Patricia. While she was initially nervous about trying ABC, she says it's been very easy to do. This is another set of technique that could be done, that could save my life also. It sounds scary, but once you get into it, it's a piece of cake. With Sunnyview, I'm Monica Mattis.